What's up guys, Sal here. So it seems the Galaxy Z Flip 5 will be the most popular foldable smartphone ever as Samsung is finally addressing the issues people had with their previous flip phones and has gone beyond expectations to make it the most impressive upgrade since its launch in 2020. We have four new big upgrades to talk about starting with the screen. You see, when Samsung launched the original Z Flip in 2020, people complained about the size of the cover screen. It was way too small to do anything. Samsung did in increase the size with subsequent models, but still if there's one complaint people have with the Z Flip line is this cover display. When competitors like Oppo are providing this beautiful big cover screen on their flip phones, the cover screen of the Z Flip 4 looks like a joke. But that won't be the case with the Z Flip 5 because IC Universe mentions that the cover screen of the Z Flip 5 is going to be bigger than the Oppo Find N2 Flip which is massive. For context, the cover screen size of the Z Flip 4 is 1.9 inches whereas it's 3 0.26 inches for Oppo's flip phone. This means the cover screen on the Z Flip 5 is growing by more than 1.4 inches, which is awesome. This would mean information being presented on the cover display would be much easier to read. Also, you can easily see yourself taking selfies with the rear camera as you'd get a good idea of how the photos will turn out as you're taking the photo. The Z Flip 5's cover screen has the potential for greater functionality. After all, it's going to boast the largest vertical cover screen on any flip phone so far. Moving on, the next big upgrade is going to be the hinge. For both the Z Flip 5 and Fold 5, Samsung will include a new dumbbell or teardrop style hinge that dramatically improves four things. First, the crease will disappear. Oppo also uses the same teardrop hinge mechanism and you can barely see any crease on their latest flip phone. Second, this hinge also allows the phone to completely fold in half without any gap in the middle. Third, it also makes the phone significantly thinner which further improves the handling of the phone. And four, it also reduces the overall weight of the phone, again improving the in-hand feel of the handset. And unlike Oppo, Samsung Z Flip 5 is still gonna be water resistant. It's unclear if Samsung is going to use the plus version of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 for the Z Flip 5 because the custom 8 Gen 2 for the S23 Ultra is actually an overclocked version of the 8 Gen 2 so it's unlikely in my opinion that Samsung would again increase the clock speeds. But hopefully they keep the prices the same as last year even though the S23's price was unchanged in the United States, the prices in the rest of the world were off the charts. Hopefully Samsung doesn't do that with this year's foldables. The Galaxy Z Fold 5 is also seeing some big upgrades bringing it closer to his ultra counterpart. To know more click here and I'll see you there.